offensive play. Well, you know what? Detmer, he's thrown just 17 passes since 99. You can't blame Coy. He's a little rusty. He falls. <laughs> oh, well. Later in the first, third and three, he'd regain his composure. Andy Reid's game plan was gorgeous. Why? Yeah. To surprise the Niners secondary. Confuse them. James Thrash taking advantage, for insta instance, with the uh, reverse. And then Detmer. The guy doesn't play much. He feels the pressure. Great play. And then side arms it to Todd Pinkston. First down. Not at the improv begins for Detmer. Second quarter to Todd Pinkston. Detmer, 18 to 26 for 227. How would he celebrate? Let's flash back. November of 98. A young Detmer after a TV pass. I don't like it. That's not good. <laughs> would the celebration be the same? I don't like it. That's not good. The official talking with him saying, hey, uh, Coy, you need a new, you Relax need a new act. You need a new act. Yeah. But I like Brian Mitchell's act. It's working. He's a lethal weapon because it's real. Two touchdowns this season. Brian Mitchell house hunting, sale. Eagles lead 14 zip. He becomes the NFL leader in combined kick returns for TDs with 13. 49ers ensuing possession. Jeff Garcia. To T.O. Terrell Owens. Garcia 29 to 51 for 284, but the Niners were playing from behind. Garcia hitting T.O. 13 catches, 166 yards, and two TDs. No Sharpie this time. Pure muscle. Under a minute to go in the second, Detmer. Antonio Freeman doing his thing into the end zone. Uh, Detmer's mansion, a little more reserved. Eagles by 14 at the break. Detmer airing it out. Feeling it. James Thrash, great catch at the one. We need another look. Great focus by Thrash. Two catches, 45 yards. The very next play, it's Detmer. I told you he was feeling it, feeling more comfortable in his position. Kind of jumps right in there for the score. Threw for two, ran for one again. No more of that, you know what, and don't let me go there. Anyway, Detmer to Jeff Thomason. That's the good news, the completion. Here's the bad. Detmer in extreme pain. He explains what happened to that left elbow. I just went back and uh, and then let the ball go, and it, after I let it go, I got pushed a little bit, and uh, I just went down to brace myself with my arm, and, and it just gave way. And uh, from there, I mean, I was just in pain. I'll tell you, when this happened, all of us in the Sports Center newsroom, oh. we could not look at it. And as you can tell, his teammates were concerned, plenty concerned. A dislocated elbow popped back into place. His teammates concerned, the opponents were concerned. An MRI Tuesday, no timetable on Detmer's return. A.J. Feely hasn't thrown a pass all year, right? There's one to Chad Lewis for the score. Just like that, 35-10. Feely, Detmer, talking about the victory. Coy Detmer, a good but tough night. Obviously, I'm disappointed uh, with the injury, but uh, you know I know the medical staff will be there. Uh, right now, I haven't had any, uh, got any time frame or anything like that. Uh, we're gonna reevaluate re it whenever we get back to Philly, and uh, just go from there. I didn't see when he landed. I didn't see what happened exactly, but <clears throat> Coy's a pretty tough nut, and if he's rolling around, you know there's something wrong. So once I got out there, you could see the dislocation. It was pretty ugly. It's been really unfortunate for both guys. But, you know, that's, I get paid just like they do. And, uh, you know, I'm here for a reason, and that's to, as an insurance policy. And now we got to cash in on it. I tell you, it's cool to be third string. Anyway, Coy Detmer, 18-26, 227, two touchdowns. He ran for another. More insight now from Sean Salisbury.